What's up everyone? This is my haul video for my anime and comic book pickups. I apologize ahead of time for the shaky cam. I'm still using my cell phone until my brand new camera arrives, but anyways, let's begin. So first off, I have the complete Street Fighter 2 collection here on DVD. Um, I originally assumed I was getting four movies spanned across four discs. But it's not. It's actually a total of 29 episodes spanned across four discs. And it comes with this awesome poster that just uh, folds out like that. And I got this for a good deal, by the way. I got this for around $25 or $27 online. Uh, brand new. I think it goes for over $100. But check out this awesome poster. It has the uh, same artwork that's on the front of the box there. Uh, in the back, it gives you the list of the episodes. So, I have a lot of catching up to do. Because I don't think i ever seen this animated series before. Um, I think there was a like American version of uh, Street Fighter 2. Uh, but this is like the Japanese animated uh, version of Street Fighter. And I know there was like, I think... Uh, one or two movies. There was Street Fighter 2 the movie, and there was like Street Fighter Alpha the movie, and there was more, I think. But this, I never knew about, so yeah, I have a lot of watching to do. Alright, next up in my recent anime collection, uh, I picked up the 25th anniversary edition of Akira. This one is a animated classic, or a Japanese animated classic seen it a billion times. I just never got around to actually buying it and owning it for myself, but I finally said, eh, what the hell, I might as well add it to my Blu-ray collection. All right, next up, one of my favorite animated series that I used to watch on Adult Swim on um, a, a Cartoon Network, Samurai Champloo. I never actually finished watching the um, entire series, and I did actually buy the uh, video game that was based off this for PS2. So glad that they have the complete um, complete series on Blu-ray. Alright, finally Cowboy Bebop, the complete series on Blu-ray. Love watching the show. Um, super, super excited that <laughs> The complete series is available on Blu-ray for affordable price too. I think this was like around twenty-five or thirty bucks. But this is one of the must-haves if you are a um, fan of anime or a anime collector. Cowboy Bebop. There's also plenty more anime series that I still have to collect and add to my collection, but um, I just got around to getting all four of these for now. All right, now moving on to my recent comic book pickups. I got Batman and Punisher, uh, both issues right here. I think they're trade paperbacks. Um, I have not read them yet, but I can't wait to read them. I think this one, he meets up with, uh, I think that's Azrael from the Nightfall series. And this one, he goes up against uh, Batman. And there's Joker in the background. Um, I cannot believe I did not know about this back in the 90s. <laughs> as big as a, a collector or comic book reader that, that I am, uh, I can't believe this went under my radar until I just recently found out about it. And uh, I was lucky enough to get both together for around 20 bucks online. So super lucky, super happy about that. All right, and finally, for my latest comic book pickups, I got a hardcover graphic novel of one of the most popular Batman comics of all time, and that is The Killing Joke by uh, Alan Moore and Brian Ballin. Now, I know about this story, heard about it like a billion times. I just, once again, never got around to actually owning most of this old, um, you know, popular stuff and adding it to my collection until now. Also, in August, I 
think the animated movie based off this graphic novel is coming out on uh, Blu-ray and DVD, so I also look forward to getting that. Uh, Alright, so that's it for this uh, short video for my latest anime and comic book pickups. Um, other videos I have planned for the upcoming week. Well, let's see, my new camera is on the way, so I might as well do an unboxing for that. Um... I did finally get around to ordering uh, Uncharted 4, the special edition, by the way, because I found it online for like 70 bucks, and it normally goes for 80 bucks. so I was like, eh, I might as well jump on that deal. Uh, I'm not sure what other unboxings I have planned. I know next two weeks, uh, Ninja Turtles Mutants in Manhattan video game comes out, so I plan on doing an unboxing for that. Um, oh, and I might have a movie review uploaded for X-Men Apocalypse, which... Um, it's getting a lot of mediocre reviews, but I'm still going to see it anyways for myself, just because it looks like a fun X-Men movie. Alright, I'm Omega Primus. Thanks for watching. I will see you guys later.